brand spanking new athletic center for kids here in Chicago in the old Irving neighborhood. I'm here with Ed who opened him to get opened it together with his wife out of basic need. Three boys that play all sorts of sports. Correct. Usually I see these in the suburbs and they have plenty of space, but they focus on a specific sport. That's not what you guys wanted to do. Correct. We wanted to build each athlete as a young person and help their muscles develop at an early age so that when they moved on to more competitive, more physical activity, lifting at the high school level, that their bodies are prepared. And injury prevention is one of our biggest things. Mm -hmm. So when you start earlier in the basic exercises, some are very similar to what you'll do in high school, yeah. but they're at a, a slower, more competitive, you know, a slower level so that they grow with their bodies and that when they get to high school, that one part of your muscle is not overworked versus another. So we test our kids quarterly, as you talked before, and we, we track them as they go and we can see their strengths and their weaknesses and we can develop training for them specifically in a group setting. Is it divided by skill level? Is it divided by age, gender? How does it work? It's well, Your team is the Red Line team, so we're all one team. So it's great with no sport, no gender. Everybody's mixed together, okay. and the trainers work with each group because everybody needs to build the same foundation as an athlete, young, and then move up. So we have everybody together, and then as we get older, we have high school classes later in the day that are more specific, more intense for team training and additional basketball training, yeah. team training. We do football training as well. And uh, so we want all the kids to come, Redline to be their team here. For those kids that don't have a team, maybe don't even have a sport yet, but when yeah. they move on, when they get to high school, there's so many more sports out there that kids go into that they didn't even know they would have an opportunity. And we want their bodies to be prepared so that you know we prevent injury and that they have a foundation in whatever they want to do, whether it's just running or playing a sport or being on a team. This is a camp going on. This you is a camp. Summer we have camp, day off camp. We have so this is our one of our spring basketball camps that we are going on now for the next three weeks because yeah. everybody has different spring breaks, as they you know. Do. So we have morning camps every day for the next four weeks and then we'll have summer camp and we'll have football camp over the summer and then we'll have nightly camps out throughout the summer you know for I all do this story sports. constantly when spring sports start about orthopedic surgeons yes correct. you know worried about kids focusing on just one sport yes. because of the injury so do you encourage let's say the basketball player to try another sport or to work out maybe something a part of their bodies that they may correct. not be so doing? we encourage all the athletes to come and do our training gotcha. our non-sports specific training first and then move on to the basketball or do it in season off season everybody doing the same type of muscle building that's not just swinging a bat which is not just shooting basketball you know they're developing their legs they're developing their balance the foundation for every sport and the first week of the first try is free to first play. trial is free mm -hmm. so everybody can come in they can check out our space first trial is free and then we have monthly options we can work with all levels of, of how often you think you can get here. We okay. do encourage quite often, especially in your off season, yeah. but even during the regular season of your baseball, whatever places where you will not get the development you need to stay on top of and come here and Fantastic. become part of the Redline family. Thank you, Ed. That's around town this morning from Redline Athletic Center. Back to you guys. Actually, we're gonna take a quick break. One of the two, your pick.